topic for this video is am I going to leave my van and move into a block building? <laughs> oh, the sun is shining so bright. Um, I have an opportunity. I'm going to go try it out a little bit this weekend and see how it works out. There's a friend of Mary Jo that uh, I have become friends with. Her name is Kelly. She lives in Fallbrook. Now, I love Fallbrook. It's country, y'all. It's not as country as it used to be back in 1980, but it's still country compared to Oceanside. So, um, she lives in a little house, a little three bedroom, two bath house that um, is owned by an old friend of hers. Well, it's a couple. And she doesn't really like living out there by herself because it is really grown up and it is kind of country and she is a bit disturbed at times by noises that she hears. It's probably a raccoon, it could be a possum, it could be somebody's stray dog. I mean, there's no telling. Could be coyotes. There's a lot of coyotes out there in the country. And we have encroached on their land so badly that they are finding it hard to live. So as a result, they are more and more used to people. They will eat little animals. I will have to be very careful with Hazel out there because they will snatch up, a coyote will snatch up a little dog Hazel side, size, I'm sorry, in a second. I did years and years and years ago, I lost a kitty cat. I'm fairly certain it was to a coyote. Um, so I will have to be very careful with Hazel out there. I'll show you guys, I'll make a little video of the property when I get out there. Now what I'm going to do, at least temporarily, is I'm just going to camp out there in tank. Now it's supposed to be 80 degrees tomorrow. So that means it's good that it's kind of um, secluded and overgrown. Snakes are my concern. Now. I can deal with a coyote, uh, raccoons don't bother me, possum are so ugly, bless their hearts, um, they can't help it, and I know that, just like I can't help how I look, but they do kind of freak me out, possums do. But anyway, um, it is secluded enough that I can have my back doors open and my barn doors on the side open, and there is shade out there, so I can always pull out my lawn chair and park out there underneath a tree or something. Although I will tell y'all, when you see palm trees and they've got all that um, dead, the dead fronds hanging from them, I have read that rats and mice like to make nests in there. So I'm not gonna be sitting under too much of that. I can tell you right now. But it should be enough. Now Kelly is gonna be gone for the weekend. She's going to house it for a friend. So I'll just be parked out there and um, at least I'm not gonna be in a public parking lot. Um, I will be taking uh, sponge baths for a couple of days, which I can totally do that. I've got plenty of water. Um, and again, it's secluded enough. If I park just right, I could open my back doors up. In fact, I have a shower curtain that I've never used. I got it. Caroline, uh, Caravan Carolyn and I picked up shower curtains. I did anyway. And um, it's real easy to use it on the back of my van. Now, I did give my shower away, but that doesn't mean that I can't soap up and then sluice off with a gallon of water that I have let 
warm up in the sun. So I am not concerned about that at all. So um, she told me it was fine to use the house, to go in, hang out, whatever. She hasn't gotten the okay from her friend for that. So I'm not comfortable doing that until she gets an okay. And she may not get one, we don't know. So anyway, um, I'm not moving permanently anywhere. Uh, MJ and I were getting on each other's last nerve and she's doing a lot better now. Um, she's doing a lot better. Uh, so, and I'm only, uh, I'm 21 miles. I'll be 21 miles from her, which is about 44 minute drive. Um, there's always lots of traffic going out from Oceanside to Fallbrook. But, um, so that's where I'm going, at least for a few days. And we'll see how that works out. So it'll be nice to be by myself again for a while. And um, I'm gonna scrub tank up really good on the inside. It's, I haven't been, I haven't cleaned anything or done anything in the week that I've been at Mary Jo's. And he's been sitting out in the sun and I have had my windows down some. He's not too dusty, but he needs a good, he needs a good bath. So, um, I don't know if she has a hose or anything out there where I could kind of give him a bath on the outside, but we'll see. No big deal. So that's what I'm doing, y'all. And I am in some horrendous traffic right now. But anyway, I'm going to see if I can turn the camera. I don't think I can. What I'm going to try to do is pause it and then turn the camera around so you can see how pretty it is out here. This to me, y'all, is real beauty. And if I can't manage this, you'll know it because this video will cut off. All right, here we go.